The following is a Chariot Pictures presentation. Nipsey Hussle is determined to leave his mark as one of the best in the world. A man who will put it all on the line. As he prepares to launch his debut album, Victory Lap, his first major record album release, we go behind the moves that helped define his career and change the landscape of the music game forever. Now on 10 Rings. Today, Los Angeles serves as the perfect backdrop to a very interesting story. The land where many tales have been told. Tell you something about my city, case you never heard. All these gangs in competition, who gonna murder more? A landmark in the hip hop scene, LA has birthed some of music's finest legends. Check out my perfect four. Straight out the eye of this perfect store. I did mine with a perfect score. And in the midst of it, a lone wolf has risen from the crowd to claim what he feels rightfully belongs to him. Heavy lies the crowd. So I'ma take it overboard. Go yard by my 44. Go hard cause this world is yours. Yeah. You never sell out. Never sell out. They can't tap you. Sometimes you got to talk that talk to him, Nipsey. He's really looked up to. I think he's a true icon and, you know, so culturally significant um, to the entire West Coast. So we don't care. No independent artist has achieved so much in so little time. But for Nipsey, it's a long time coming. Hey! It's finally getting the, um, the light shine back on him. Because, you know, we all been listening to the Atlanta people. Even everybody in LA, we so soaked up with the South culture. It's like the lights back on us now, and it's, it's been a while since it's been on us. Nipsey Hussle exploded onto the scene and became more than just a local home favorite. His talents grew and his name forever forged among the greats and a hero to those who came from hardship growing up. Nip, actually, since we've been little, he always been geared towards music. Um, I remember little kids hustling and getting money. In an environment where selling music has been naturally challenging, Nipsey welcomed the odds and did something that no one has ever done before. He and his team did the unimaginable, and as Forbes reported, he went on to develop a mixtape called Crenshaw and produced only 1,000 copies. He sold them for $100 each. Marketing, um you say a um, marketing genius project called Crenshaw. A bold move that was never done before. It got the attention of a familiar face in the game. With a respect for his craft and marketing ingenuity, Jay-Z purchased 100 CDs and wired $10,000 instantly. Nipsey even showed the bank wire receipt on social media. With all CDs selling out within 24 hours, it was official he could not be ignored. With more success from his next releases, such as Mailbox Money, The Marathon Continues, and Slauson Boy 2, he was slowly becoming a household name. Nipsey is surrounded by his closest, who share a common goal to grow the empire they so humbly started and take the next step in their journey. He's faced with one of the most controversial questions for any independent artist, whether to sign to a major record label, one of the most difficult choices he's ever made. For Nipsey, he's never had the problem of getting offers. For him, it's all about the right fit. Um, I was at Warner Brothers when we first started discussing the deal, and um, we, we had um, you know, a few talks, and then the, the talks started heating up, and um, he was open up to like negotiating for a deal. Um, because everybody knew he was, you know, he had a big independent stance. With so many labels looking for a chance to add him to their roster, only one label stood out from the rest. They flew to New York City to see for themselves. Only worry about the brain, I'm a urbanist. 
even know. Next level look, still achieving the most. Seven days is my Three thousand miles away from home, he arrives to the city that never sleeps. In the back, feeling like Jigga and the GS. Atlantic Records. Making the rounds, Nipsey takes meetings all around, shaking hands and playing music off his brand new unreleased album, Victory Lap, his first highly awaited debut album. He feels it's the best work he's ever made. Half a million Uncle Sam, hate to see it go. All money in the squad, nigga, even though. Conversations that once involved only a small circle, now in the hands of a team. A team of professionals who've been given the task of manifesting his vision how he sees fit. The transition can be difficult. The challenges has just definitely been um, transitioning him from, you know, being the independent artist, you know, really just having to deal with his team to like opening up to like, you know, trusting more people and giving his music to people that he doesn't know, just like where they could do what they have to do, um, whatever department they're in. But, you know, it was really just like a trust thing. Like he had to get more involved with more people. And when you come from an independent place, you're not used to having all these people involved with your music. It's been a long journey up to this point, and he's put it all into his album, a body of work that will propel him as one of the greatest to ever do it. It's his resilience and passion that has brought him here. A journey filled with purpose. For smooth seas don't make strong sailors. And for Nipsey, things have not always been so easy. And even more deeper concerns. I will speak on one of the um, major challenges that we already uh, went through. Uh, one of our business partners uh, in the label, uh, Stephen Donaldson. Uh, we just lost him uh, probably about three or four weeks ago. And uh, uh, he was actually supposed to be here right now with us, the whole team. So that's a, that, that was one of the major hard things. And, and uh, that's, that's going to be something that's going to be on everybody's hearts. And gonna be, It's going to be something hard to deal with, and, and uh, he, he's a big part of why I feel that we are even here. Nipsey and his team now face the next challenge in his career to receive a positive response from both the streets and the industry alike. But an eager crowd of executives highly anticipating new music can be difficult for any creative. A daunting task for any artist to face, Nipsey rises to the occasion. He feels relaxed, he looks right at home. He likes the challenge, a chance to have them understand what makes him unique, a chance to hear the music, and offer a glimpse into who he truly is. Nipsey plays the most cutting-edge music ever recorded in his career, with all of his triumphs and pain accompanied by the most stunning composition of instrumentation, produced by the best in the world. A positive response that is received with open praise. See, they mad at us. There are no shortcuts for greatness. One must be prepared to fill a role only reserved for the few. Super, super excited about Victory Lap. I think he's made an incredible album, and you know I can't wait to get it out there. Through backdoor negotiations, Nipsey strikes a multi-million-dollar joint venture with Atlantic Records. Now preparing to launch his newly prized album, Victory Lap, Nipsey and his new alliance plan to show the world what he's made of—a bittersweet celebration of a long time coming. And now, a new beginning.